How do you create an Amazon business account? Whether you're a sole proprietor or a large organization, uh, Amazon business accounts as well as Business Prime allows you to have a lot of savings, get a lot of discounts, also bulk purchasing, um, you know, high volume orders. They can manage a lot of that delivery stuff. And there's just a lot more to Amazon business and having a business account than just having personal Prime accounts or personal Amazon accounts. Uh, there's a link in the description that will take you to this business landing page. And you can see here that as you scroll down, you can learn a little bit more about what Amazon business is. You can look through some of the ways that it has helped shape other businesses, save money, uh, as well as give them a lot of different analytics tools, business buying tools, etc. And the business prime, which is like Amazon prime for businesses is a huge time saver and a huge money saver as well. So you can see you get, free delivery, you get rewards, surveys, analytics tools. You can also empower your team as far as creating policies and guides for preferred purchasing behavior. So there's a lot here that you can do and manage over just having individual Prime accounts, as well as if you're a sole proprietor and you're just a solo uh, business owner, you actually get fr a free business prime account with your personal Amazon prime account. So you don't have to have a sec a secondary account that you pay for. And so you can create that free account. And then if you have a business with, you know, five users that need this or more, there's different pricing structures. As you know, if you have Amazon prime, it's over a hundred dollars a year right now. So five users would be over 500 plus dollars. But here with the essentials, you get five users for 179 a year. And so that is a huge savings. You can see for small organizations, medium and enterprise where you get unlimited users, etc. You can contact sales for those, but you can create free accounts for some of these others, as well as get other um, different benefits as you are picking larger uh, prime accounts here. And you also get 5% cash back or 5% back with your purchases. So basically there's Amazon business, there's business prime, and then there's Amazon prime with that. And you can read through some of this and see the impacts on some of these businesses. Now, if you're going to sign up, you actually can create a free account real easily. So if we go back to that landing page, you can just click create a free account. Now this is going to use an email uh, that you already have, whether it's your Amazon account. And if it's a personal account, you're going to be converting it to a business account, or you can use a different work email. Uh, work emails are preferred here. Now I'm not going to convert this account into a business account, but I will use a different email. Uh, this would be, so my pixel in bracket at gmail.com email. Uh, preferably it would be a work email address, not just a Gmail address, but it kind of depends on whether you're a larger organization or just somebody who's just getting their business up and running. And so from here to create that account, we would go in and kind of enter in the information and we're basically creating an account for that email. So of course we'd put in a password. And once we have that password in there, we can go to the next step, which would be verifying your email address. Now, of course, in this situation, it appears I already had an Amazon account with that email address. So I'm actually going to change this to a different Gmail and we will just do the same thing here and then verify that email. So Amazon will send you an email with a one time security code. All you have to do is enter that and then it's going to create that Amazon account. And once we create that account, it's going to move on to the next page, which is your business details. So you're going to have a business phone number. We're going to fill in your business information. So, uh, you know, whatever your LLC or your corporation name is, you're going to fill that in here, whether it's sole proprietor or other. And then of course your business address. And so as you fill in these details, you're also going to need your EIN number. You're also going to need uh, potentially some of your like articles of organization and different uh, paperwork ready for the next few steps. But once you fill in all of your business information and finish, that account will get approved and then you'll be signed up for Amazon business. Amazon business for any uh, legitimate businesses. Of course, that's what all the paperwork and this approval process is. But you sign up for a free account and you're going to have Amazon business and have that business prime if you're sole proprietor or sign up for 
uh, paying for more users if you need more. And that's how you can create a business account here on Amazon.